Hello, hello, my beautiful booze. I've got a video for you guys today. I've got the model ones with me today. These are the dip powder, their Halloween collection. You get several jars here. It looks like there's four, five, six, seven. there's eight. And then you get your four liquids. Super nice. But we're going to be swatching these for you guys today. Oh, let's just look. It says the number on the bottom. I think they're. I don't know if you can purchase them individually, but I'll have them linked down below for you guys so that way you can go check it out. But let me go ahead and get these open and we'll get started. Okay, so I've got the first one here. All right, this is a holographic. Now, holographic doesn't show very well on screen, but we'll do our best, huh? And then they also send you a clear, which you'll need a clear whenever you're doing glitter for dip powder because you always want to put a layer of clear so you don't file the glitter off. So, if you do not have a clear, which it comes in the set, so you'll have a clear, but if you do not want to use this, you can use any clear acrylic powder that will work as well. So, I'm just going to move those over there so I don't knock them off. Okay, so the first thing that you're going to do is get the number one. Now, remember, this is a system that you probably need to let dry. For a minute before you start filing it does take a little longer sometimes it just really depends um, but if you're doing a full set so it, sh it should be okay so So it looks like I may have to pour some of it over, which is okay. Um, we can do that. So I'm just going to take the glue and I'm going to go back over this. Now it's going to turn this matte finish, okay? Because where it's um, glitter, it's like when, anytime you cover a glitter with acrylic, it's going to turn matte. So, oh God, why did I do that? going to look like that. We'll leave it to the side for just a second. Um, before I do that though, I'm going to actually take the number two, the activator. And we're going to apply it to this now. That way the acrylic will actually dry. I'm just going to make sure that it's fully, fully covered like that. Alright, so the next one I'm going to do, I'm going to do this beautiful black one. Okay guys, so I lost some footage on my video, so I switched over to these smaller uh, swatches here. I had it all done recorded and went back to start editing and realized that my clip went missing and got deleted somehow. So switching it over to these, I'm going to go through and swatch these really fast for you, the colors that I didn't get. 
and we're gonna check them out. So now you already seen the glitter ones already that I did. These are so beautiful, guys. I really want to see if these work as acrylic as well. Super excited. So make sure that you're mixing everything. And like I do said, to remember you also get a clear in this kit. But let's just go ahead and open them up. That red, guys, that red is so freaking stunning. It's more like a maroon color, like a, but it's got the shimmer to it. Oh, it's so pretty. And then this beautiful black. And then you've got this gray, really perfect for Halloween. And then we have this one here, and this is like a silver uh, metallic. Or, no, 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 not this one. Shucks, wrong one. Let's see. No, it's the, uh, that was something I was like, okay, this one is more like a gunmetal. Gunmetal uh, glitter. Really pretty. So anyways, I'm going to do these really fast for you guys. I'll speed it up so that way it won't take so long. But I am really sorry for losing that content. I was so, so irritating. But I did get, <clears throat> but I did get smaller uh, swatches too because the stiletto tips didn't want to fit down inside these bottles. So anyways, let's get started. So now, once again, you need to let these fully, fully um, 
I'm actually going to wipe this glue off, I think. Because I don't want my lid to, to stick on it. For just a second until they completely dry. Shouldn't take very long. A couple minutes and they should be completely dry. That is so pretty though. I absolutely love that color. They're all pretty actually. They have like a shimmer to them as well. The black doesn't, of course. But now those are gorgeous. Okay, so when you go over the second set, you apply the same way. So what I do is I like, like I said, I come to the top, pull it down, and then side off. So once they're fully dried, you're just going to take your file and you're just going to file everything in shape. And this is the top coat that comes in the kit. And then I just touch the sides and done. So let's see how this one turns out and then we'll talk about doing the other ones. Sometimes I like the top coat, sometimes I don't. just really depends on it itself. So... And here are the final results, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what you guys think down below. I absolutely love these colors. Like, they're really great for Halloween and everything. Glitters are beautiful. Love that hollow and that black right there. It's amazing. But anyways, you guys let me know down below what you guys think. If you like this kit or not, it'll be linked down below for you guys. That way you can go check it out. Don't forget to use my code. Use my link. And I hope that you love these. Like I said, don't forget to subscribe if you are new here. Let's be friends and do nail art together. And don't forget to share this video and comment as well. But anyways, guys, hope you're having a wonderful Halloween, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.